How's it going, everybody? So in this video, I'm going to talk about how to get rid of sebaceous filaments on your chin. So before I get started, please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I do appreciate um, the support. It helps my channel grow. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999. Sebaceous filaments are small accumulations um, of sebum and dead skin cells that form around hair follicles. Um, they're very tiny as well. Um, some people confuse sebaceous filaments with blackheads. They are not the same thing though. Um, a sebaceous filament can be squeezed out while a blackhead cannot be. Um, so what is the best way to get rid of them? Um, tip one um, is going to be enzyme peels. They work on the upper epidermal layer, so the, the, the outer layer, and um, dead cells on the skin surface. Um, they use Cadillac enzymes that help to trigger the breakdown of keratin in the skin. So, kind of confusing. Um, you don't really need to know the whole breakdown of what it is, just use it. And um, you're gonna see a big, big difference by using enzyme peels. Um, next one is going to be gels, creams and gels, lots of different nasal creams and gels. Um, th they're meant for sebaceous filaments and they work by removing it. So lots of different products out there. I don't know all of the different products because in my opinion, there's just so many new products coming out. Literally go on Google, do some reviews on the best um, sebaceous filament creams and gels and it'll tell you there'll be like millions of reviews um, tweezers can pull out the sebaceous filaments so in my opinion that would be the first step that I would do is I would use the tweezers then I would try the enzyme peels and then finally I would go to um, the creams and gels Another one is exfoliating. You want to do this on a day-to-day -day basis. What exfoliating is, the, the definition, if you look up exfoliating, it's removing dead skin cells. Um, so that's all you're doing. You're, you're removing the daily um, dead skin cells and there's lots of different exfoliators out there. They're all basically going to be the same, so pick one. Um, baking soda can work too. Um, it is used as a natural skin exfoliator. So uh, for the skin exfoliator, if you want, you can try baking soda. And yeah, end of video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Please follow me on Instagram, Dillenberg999.